This Sunday is Easter and all weekend long events are happening all around San Diego and including the one we're going to tell you about right now. Yeah, on Saturday, kids of all ages will be hunting for eggs and joining us tonight to speak about the Peace in the Park egg hunt is San Diego Police Department Officer Omar Luzuriaga. Thank you. Omar, thank you for coming. We appreciate you coming here today. Tell us a little bit more about Peace in the Park. Yeah, thank you. And it's a pleasure to be here and thank you for allowing me to promote this event. Uh, that it's occurring this weekend in our beautiful city. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, it all started a few years ago uh, where the feedback from the community was that our parks were being overrun by uh, criminal activity. A lot of gangs, drugs, um, prostitution and such. And one of the ways we decided to outweigh the bad with the good was to start peace in the park. And, uh, and this Saturday we have the pleasure of starting, uh, continuing that tradition. It's yeah. like taking it back, right? Because yeah. parks are places where we get to hang out with our kids mm -hmm. and go, to, you know, to feel safe. And, and in the past years, it just really hasn't. Yeah, so again, tell us why this is so important to San Diego. So uh, this, this is important for a lot of reasons. One of them being that we, uh, as police officers, we get the opportunity to interact with the community in a positive atmosphere. Mm -hmm. uh, not only that, we get the opportunity to promote peace and unity and partner up with different organizations that uh, bring resources to a community where it's much needed. It's nice when kids and, and families um, get to, to see you out in the public and interact. It, it really changes the dynamic out there 100%. on the streets for you too as well. Yes, 100% and uh, it also opens that trust with the community, right? I, I mean, uh, we now build relationships through just a one day course. We build with the relationships with the community that surrounds those parks and it allows them to call us whenever there's a concerning matter. Is there one place where this particular event is taking part? Because I know I've done them in the past, like mm -hmm. Rancho Mendosquitos where I live, they had the Easter egg hunt, but tell us more about this particular spot. Yeah, so we're, uh, we're this, this year we're actually gonna be at the Mount View uh, neighborhood in the Mount View par uh, Park and this is it's going to be located at 641 South Boundary Street and uh, we're going to be out there uh, Saturday the 8th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. 40 plus organizations coming out uh, anywhere from nonprofits local churches local businesses um, as well as uh, uh, health health uh, a lot of health care and uh, we're just out there to have a good family fun I, I got to ask you about this because I remember when we did this, they had like age ages staggered, so like you know the little kids wouldn't get <laughs> yeah, trampled. So they wouldn't get trampled so when they're out there. Yeah. yeah, so so it starts at 11, but how are you going to do that? So there's uh, there's five different egg hunts. Uh, uh, we separate them by age groups, mm -hmm. anywhere from zero to 13 plus adults. Uh, we're going to be every by the hour, starting at 11 a.m. By the hour, we're going to have different age, age groups. And you know what? It's it's open to the entire family. Is there an entrance fee or anything like that, or is it's, it free? It's a free community event. We just want uh, we just want participation from everybody in the community. So, are, are there prizes involved? There is. There really? is. As oh, a matter of a fact, new car perhaps? Uh, uh, <laughs> no, <laughs> not quite. Sign no. Me up for that, okay. Though. Yeah. Right. So, as a matter <laughs> of fact, um, we're going to be giving out gift baskets, um, and it, it is uh, it is going to be a prize that it's going to be raffled through the egg hunt portion. Of it. You know, I was just looking at some of the people who have just, you know, who have joined in and become sponsors of this event. Yes. And there's a lot of resources for people just to come out. So whether it's actually just meeting you guys and actually feeling more comfortable with the law enforcement in their community, or just finding the resources that they need within the community, right. it just really is a great place to be. Yeah, and in addition to that, we want to make, uh, we want to create awareness that these resources are not there just one day out of the year. These resources are year round. And, and that's what's important, that most of these organizations are going to be there to say, hey, we're here, we're here to help, and we're here to stay to, and help. You know, this is a great recruitment tool. Yeah. When you think about it. Right? Exactly. Right? exactly. Yeah, think about our it. recruiting department will be there, uh -huh. as well as our uh, canine unit, and uh, we're going to have different juvenile service teams mm -hmm. that are just going to be out there uh, creating that relationship with the kids. Will they be putting it. on a show with the dogs as well, or anything like that? Uh, or will I, they just I sure be out hope there? so. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, uh, you know, nothing's been confirmed so far, but mm -hmm. they're going to be out there, so I'm a, I'm a I'm going to assume there's going to be some surprises good. and good ones. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And it's a, it's a family fun day. I mean, we just want people to come out, enjoy the day with us, and uh, I'm sure there won't be no disappointment. No, and no rain, too. That's right. And no great. rain, you have oh, a great day. Weather. Yes, yeah. exactly. Okay. Right. Well, if you want more information on this, you can learn about the Peace at the Park hunt. Of course, go to fox5sandiego.com and click 
on the scene on Fox 5 tab. Thank you so much for coming Thank in you guys. today. Thank you guys. Yep. Officer Omar Luzuriaga. I didn't <laughs> yeah. want to botch it, so I wanted to make sure I said I'm it correctly. Glad she Thank took you it so on. much. I appreciate it. We appreciate Thank you coming you. in. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck with that.